Now let's go downstairs to Ralph Kiner with Roger McDowell. And usually where Roger is, there's always trouble, and this time it wasn't caused by Roger. You can't blame this one on you, Roger. No, not at all. I, I don't know what trouble has happened, but I, I, I haven't caused any, and I'm, I'm free, and I'm, I'm, in the, I'm in the innocent right you, here. You're on the outside of it and watching all this action go on that usually is caused by you. The glasses, uh, that's, a, that's very smart because well, this stuff well, really burns. I thought about it throughout the course of the year, and, 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 and as you can see, Ralph, you're covering your eyes because you know the champagne burns, but I, I can sit here and speak freely because, you know, I have these goggles on. They're not going to get in. Uh, they're not going to make contact with my eyes, and it's, this is wonderful, you know. And if you're watching, Bobby, we're thinking about you, and, uh, you know, Take it in, baby. Well, one thing for sure. Well, one thing for sure is my hairdresser's going to be pissed at me. <laughs> well, Roger, certainly was nice knowing you, and I hope I never have to talk to you like this again. Okay, thanks, Ralph. Maybe you might have to, you know. Maybe two more situations, and uh, hopefully we'll be in those situations. And maybe I can get you a pair of goggles. I'm going to come in that way the next time. And I really do hope it happens again, Roger. Thanks, Ralph. Great year. Thank you. Right now, let's go. Let's go over the other side to Tim McCarver.